Right off the bat, James and Sheila knew something wasn't right. Just the way he approached us, I've never had an officer ever approach me like that. At first off, he really wasn't trying to show a badge like a normal person was. It was one of those quick flash and try to take away. He didn't introduce himself by any name. The couple walking in their neighborhood this weekend when a man pulled up, claiming to be a cop, asking about drugs. And then um, started showing a badge, stating that uh, he was looking for drug dealers. That today was his last day in order to prevent everybody in the neighborhood's house from being raided. Uneasy McGuire took this picture of the car and then called police, who eventually caught up with the driver, Dan Forstall, a firefighter and state representative. Very surprised that it was a politician or a state representative for however you label them. Forstall now facing three charges, including felony counts of impersonating an officer and DUI. According to court papers, he was also at a bar asking for cocaine and once stopped by officers threatened to have their badges pulled. I mean, to have a state representative doing drugs, drinking and driving, it's, I mean, you're teaching the wrong message to people. Obviously, we're electing the wrong people in the office. Um, I mean, it's one thing to just catch an OWI or a DUI and say, oh, my bad, I made a mistake, but we're talking looking for drug dealers for whatever his purpose was. So far, a first court appearance for Forrestal has not been set. In Indianapolis, Alan Carter, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.